Welcome to Trand Hub like and subscribe for more updates. Tonight, across the Philippines, a restless energy pulses through the cities and towns. The glow of city lights masks a growing anxiety as millions brace for what the night may bring. A sense of unease hangs in the humid air, thick and heavy, as people gather outside waiting and watching, uncertain of what's to come. News headlines flash urgently. Manila faces rolling blackouts as power reserves dwindle. The warnings are everywhere, on every screen and every radio. Electricity prices are set to soar amidst global fuel volatility, leaving families and businesses scrambling to keep up with the rising costs. For millions these aren't just headlines, they're daily struggles, flickering lights that threaten to go out at any moment, silent factories that once buzzed with life, spoiled food in warm refrigerators, and livelihoods at risk. The nation holds its breath, wondering if the power will stay on through the night, or if darkness will once again take over their homes and streets. Families scramble to budget for rising bills, cutting back on essentials just to keep the lights on. Small businesses fear closure as every blackout chips away at their fragile profits. The government urges energy conservation, underscoring the seriousness of the crisis and calling on every citizen to do their part. The entire economy, the comfort of every home and the rhythm of modern life are tied to a fragile power grid, one that now teeters on the edge. The Philippines, an archipelago of over 7,000 islands, has long relied on imported fuels, leaving it exposed to global market shocks and supply disruptions beyond its control. As the crisis deepens, one name stands out, Malampaya. This vital gas field has powered millions of homes and businesses for decades. Once a cornerstone of energy security, its reserves are now dwindling, raising urgent questions about the nation's future. The nation's hopes rest on a high-stakes effort, Malampaya Phase 4 a last chance to secure a brighter, more stable energy future. The outcome will shape the lives of millions and determine whether the lights stay on for generations to come. The Philippines' energy story is shaped by its unique geography and the pressing needs of its growing population. As an archipelago of over 7,000 islands, the country faces significant challenges in building a stable and self-sufficient energy system. Lacking vast land-based fossil fuel reserves, the Philippines has long depended on imported coal and liquefied natural gas to keep its lights on and industries running. Giant ships regularly bring in fuel from Indonesia, Australia, and the Middle East. These shipments are lifelines for the national power grid, ensuring electricity flows to homes and businesses. But this heavy reliance on foreign fuel is both costly and risky, leaving the country exposed to forces beyond its control. When global prices spike, Filipino consumers feel the impact immediately, with electricity bills that can soar unpredictably from month to month. The nation's economic stability is at the mercy of distant events. Political disputes, shipping disruptions or sudden surges in global demand can all threaten the steady flow of fuel. Geopolitical risks loom large, limiting the country's foreign policy options and exposing the Philippines to energy leverage by more powerful nations. Environmentally, burning imported coal worsens air pollution and greenhouse gas emissions, locking the Philippines into a carbon-intensive energy mix that threatens both public health and climate goals. This triple threat, economic vulnerability, geopolitical exposure, and environmental harm, traps the nation in a cycle it's desperate to break, with each challenge reinforcing the others. The urgency to find a domestic solution has never been greater, as leaders and experts search for ways to secure a more stable and sustainable energy future. The country's future prosperity and security depend on breaking free from this risky dependence and charting a new path forward. The search for energy independence is now a national imperative, one that will shape the destiny of generations to come. For two decades, the Malampaya gas field was the Philippines' answer to energy insecurity. Discovered in 1991, it became the backbone of the Luzon grid, supplying up to 30% of its electricity. Malampaya reduced reliance on imports, stabilized prices and cut emissions, fueling economic growth and national pride. But its reserves were always finite. By the late 2010s, production began to decline. Power plants turned to more expensive fuels, and the threat of shortages returned. The government and energy sector grew anxious as the country faced a return to near-total dependence on imports. Exploration had slowed, and the original service contract was set to expire, adding uncertainty. As gas flow dwindled, urgency mounted. The Philippines stood at a crossroads. Could Malampaya be saved, or was its golden age over? The answer would shape the nation's energy future. 
The clock was ticking. A bold new plan was needed, fast. Just as hope faded, a new plan emerged. Malampaya Phase 4. Instead of searching elsewhere, engineers would drill two new deep water wells, Malampaya East and Ilok Ilok, using advanced technology to tap remaining reserves. Prime Energy Resources, a Filipino-led company, took the helm, investing heavily and bringing in world-class expertise. The project's success could extend Malampaya's life and stabilize the nation's power supply. Drilling in over 800 meters of water, the team uses seismic imaging and a state-of-the-art drill ship to reach untapped gas pockets. New wells will connect to the existing platform via subsea pipelines, a complex engineering feat. This is more than a technical challenge, it's a strategic pivot toward energy independence. Malampaya Phase 4 is a declaration. The nation is not giving up on its most vital energy asset. The project aims to bridge the energy gap while renewables ramp up. Its success is crucial for a stable transition to a cleaner energy future. The commitment to Malampaya Phase 4 became real with the arrival of the Noble Viking, a cutting-edge deep-water drill ship. In early 2025, its towering derrick signaled the start of a new drilling campaign. The Noble Viking, equipped with dynamic positioning and advanced safety systems, is designed for the challenging conditions of the West Philippine Sea. On board, a skilled crew works around the clock, supported by a global consortium of experts. The Philippine government streamlined permits and renewed service contract 38 until 2039, providing legal certainty and national backing. President Marcos Jr.'s signature on the extension was a clear endorsement of the project's importance. The alignment of technology, expertise, and government support has created powerful momentum. Malampaya Phase 4 is now underway, its promise within reach. Malampaya Phase 4's promise is simple, keep the lights on for the Filipino people. By boosting domestic gas supply, it aims to prevent blackouts and stabilize the Luzon grid. For families, this means reliable electricity, essential for daily life and peace of mind. Reviving Malampaya can also lower electricity bills, shielding consumers from global price swings. The project creates jobs, stimulates local economies and supports a network of suppliers and service providers. Cleaner burning natural gas reduces harmful emissions, improving air quality and public health. Extending Malampaya's life helps the Philippines meet climate goals while transitioning to renewables. The benefits ripple across society, economic, environmental and social. It's a practical step toward a greener, more secure energy mix. The nation's future depends on its success. Malampaya Phase 4 brings hope, but also environmental responsibility. The West Philippine Sea is rich in biodiversity and vital to coastal communities. Deep water drilling poses risks, spills, pollution, and ecosystem disruption. Operators and government enforce strict environmental regulations and safety protocols. A comprehensive environmental impact assessment guides every step, with measures to protect marine life and manage waste. The DNER closely monitors compliance, while the Noble Viking is equipped with advanced safety systems like blowout preventers. Crew members undergo rigorous safety training, and emergency drills are routine. Marine biologists monitor coral reefs and fish populations to ensure minimal impact. The goal extract vital energy while safeguarding the environment. Public trust and long-term sustainability depend on this delicate balance. Malampaya's revival required decisive government action. President Marcos Jr. made energy independence a top priority, pushing agencies to cut red tape and fast-track permits. Renewing service contract 38 for 15 years gave operators the security to invest in Phase 4. The Department of Energy led a coordinated effort, streamlining approvals and ensuring the project stayed on schedule. This proactive stance signals to investors that the Philippines is serious about developing its own energy resources. The government is also promoting new exploration opportunities, aiming to attract more investment. Malampaya's success is a test case for the nation's energy ambitions. If it succeeds, it could unlock a new era of investment and innovation. As the noble Viking drills deep beneath the West Philippine Sea, it's searching for more than just gas. Beneath the waves, it's unearthing the promise of a brighter tomorrow for every Filipino. Every turn of the drill is a step toward securing the nation's future, fueling hope and progress for generations to come. Malampaya Phase 4 is a bold move to regain control of the Philippines' energy destiny, a project that stands as a symbol of national pride and ambition. If successful, it will provide stable, affordable domestic energy for years, powering homes, businesses and industries across the archipelago. This vital energy source gives the country time to diversify and invest in renewables, paving the way for a cleaner, greener future. 
Reducing reliance on imports means greater economic stability, more predictable electricity prices, and less vulnerability to global market shocks. Cleaner natural gas helps meet environmental commitments and smooths the transition to solar, wind, and geothermal power. The risks are real, technical, environmental, and financial, but the alternative is unacceptable, a future marked by persistent shortages and soaring prices. Without projects like Malampaya, the nation faces the threat of blackouts, economic setbacks, and uncertainty for millions. This project is a testament to Filipino ingenuity and resolve, uniting experts, workers, and communities in pursuit of a common goal. Malampaya Phase 4 is a story of hope and national determination, inspiring the next generation to dream bigger and reach higher. The platform's glow is no longer fading. Its lights shine as a beacon of progress and resilience. It's lighting the way to a stronger, more self-reliant Philippines, where energy security empowers every citizen. The dawn of a new energy era has begun, and with it, the promise of a resilient, empowered nation, ready to face the future.